from Center City in Philadelphia. This is Fox 29 News at 10. Well, for decades, doctors have been freezing unwanted warts, tags, and moles off your skin without cutting. But it's a deep freeze that's packing people into cosmetic surgeons this summer and fall. In Your Health Tonight, Joyce Evans looks at a surge in melting fat from under your skin and inches off your figure by freezing it. The problem is age old. And try as you might. Oh, man, too much. After two kids, it's definitely my middle. My stomach. Woo, stubborn, small pockets of fat hang on. Right here. It's always an issue, no matter what I do. I definitely got rid of my belly there. Ugh, it's nasty. It's like jello. You just can't seem to burn it away. Mm, a little bit of cellulite on my thighs. It refuses to leave. It found the home, and it doesn't want to go. Numerous cosmetic procedures can handle that, but... I don't want anesthesia. I don't want to be cut. And you don't want to be laid up. I don't have time to waste. Don't need to. These ads say... The treated fat cells won't come back. Deep freeze that fat away. And I was like, what is that? Oh, it's a gel pad. It kind of protects the skin, allows the suction to really kind of latch on so that the cooling will affect the fat layer underneath and not the skin. It sucks in a section at a time, real snug, like a vacuum cleaner, and puts a freeze on it for one hour. Yes. It feels like a very mild suction. How are you feeling? I'm feeling cool. It's a little cool, but it's not uncomfortable. Because fat cells freeze and die quicker, doctors say no damage is caused to other tissue, muscles, and skin. The fat, now frozen like a stick of butter, then gradually and naturally melts its way out of your body. Sounds like science fiction, right? But the cool science behind this year's hottest fat reduction treatment is actually nothing new, says laser expert and dermatologist Dr. Eric Bernstein. As dermatologists, we knew that babies who have a lot of unsaturated fat could actually lose areas of fat in their cheek from a popsicle. So, scientists set out to simulate that popsicle effect on adult glove handles. If they have a pinchable area of fat that would be easily suctioned into the applicator piece, they can actually do this procedure. Kate and Flory volunteered to be models at an open house at Mainline Laser Surgery, one of many doctor's offices and medical spas now offering demonstrations of cool sculpting. People lose approximately 20 to 25 percent of the fat in the treated areas. It was FDA approved in 2010, but only for fat reduction of upper and lower abdomen and flanks. I can't wait to see the results and get rid of the little belly bulge. Availability exploded this summer when smaller attachments made treating areas like back fat and inner thighs possible. It's not FDA cleared yet uh, for treating inner thighs, but lots of docs are doing it, including us, uh, and people are really happy with the results. I'm really excited to see that uh so it works for me. Right side. Plastic and reconstructive surgeon Jason Bloom actually tried out cool sculpting on himself first. And in fact, I've seen probably about a 25% um, reduction in my uh, lower abdomen. He lost one full pant size, and he says he's game to get more because this technology may have more tricks in its bag. I think down the line, um, some additional areas of treatment could be uh, the saddlebags and the outer thighs. Possibly the um, the arm fat and the results. Well, we'll see. We'll see in three to six months if Kate and Flory get the results they want. Doctors do caution people, though, this is not a quick way to lose a lot of weight. It's just for sculpting away stubborn fat. Also, the device cannot be used over scars, like from a surgery. Numbness may occur seven to ten days after, and the procedure is pretty pricey, $1,400 to $1,500 a session. Joyce Evans, Fox 29 News.